channel. Um, we are back with Parenthood LP. I'm kind of thinking this is going to be the last episode, but I think I've said that for the last three episodes. <laughs> um, but on the last part we left off and she's in labor. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, let's see. We're going to have her have the baby at the hospital. We're going to join her. And now we have a decision to make. I know 100% that her husband is going to go. Mm, but do we want Nadir to go? Because honestly, we already know the deal. We just want to see what's going to happen. So... I don't know, look at their bars, like she's more friends with him. And they do have a, of course, a relationship bar, but I don't know. It's like she doesn't even really talk to him. But we're gonna, oh, you can only have one person go. Hmm. Yeah. Is Jackson at work? Nope, he's off. So to be a little weird, if we don't invite Jackson, considering he's home. So since we can only invite one person. Um, now I'm trying to figure out whether I want Jackson or Leah to go. Like, like she's just like, no, I just take her. It's fine. Um, we'll have her husband go. So we're going to go ahead and get back in this. Look at her. She's just so upset right now I need you to go to the hospital though thank you okay so here we are at the hospital and Jackson has already freaked out and left so we're just gonna go and check in at the front desk last time I did this it really just kind of messed up but we're gonna see if it works because I really want her to have the baby at the hospital Hey, Miss Candy. Is she pregnant too? Yeah. Look at her. He's like, okay, what are you here for? Are you crazy? Do you see? I downloaded this um, Bills mod and it's not what I thought it was. I thought it was the one where you could separate the money. But if it is and anybody knows how, can you guys just let me know? Why is Jackson... What is he doing? Why is he dressed like that? Like he's some secret spy or something. I guess at this point he can't go back in the room. Maybe. I don't know why he's eating and not accompanying her. Okay, here we go, guys. Uh-oh. I think Terrell is coming over. Love Day was awful. Of course, she's giving birth. Okay, here he comes. Look. What's he doing? He's like, oh my God, it's a baby. What is happening? Okay, get in here. It's a boy. Oh, okay. So, um, <laughs> mm, um, We're going to name him. I thought I had some names up here. I guess not. We're going to name him. <laughs> um, we're going to name him Nathan. There's a method behind my madness. I saw a bunch of names that started with a J, but that wouldn't really be cool. Now would it? Last name might have to change as well. There we go. Oh my God, it's twin boys. I think we saw that, but I thought it was a boy and a girl. Um, We have Nathan and... Okay, his name is Jackson. 
I think we'll do Jaden. Oh my god, that's so bad. Ooh. I think we're gonna do Jaden. Oh boy, let's see how this goes. Is he gonna come say hi to his babies? Why did she change back into her hospital get up? Okay, so what are we doing? Are we going home? Um, okay, so we are back home and we have the birth certificates. I promise you, it sounds like she just said, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, did the birth certificates say anything? I don't think they do. I thought I had the mod in, but I guess I don't. Now, um, geez, we have two. Oh my goodness. Um, we have two more babies. The cutest babies ever. They are in Leah's room, not Leah, Jaleesa's room. And I'm sure that's not going to go very well. So, um, they need a room. <laughs> they definitely need a room. Where is Leah? Oh, she's downstairs washing clothes. She doesn't want to know, I guess. All right. I think I'm going to move Jaleesa down here with Leah. And let the babies have the room upstairs. Seems like all the older kids get moved downstairs. But Leah is getting ready to leave anyway. We're going to check the mail and make sure that... Um, yeah, we'll have Jaleesa come in here. Because... Um, It's going to be fine. We'll work it out. <laughs> Once Leah uh, leaves, we'll go ahead and um work it out. I'll, I'll do something in between parts probably. But this may be the last time that we see um, this family. So I don't know. It depends on um what happens with the... Uh, male. This is two boys and they're in a pink room. So I'm going to change all this and it, you know, it won't really make a difference, I guess. Let's at least change that. Okay. There we go. So, uh, is Jaleesa's, um, birth certificate in here I don't know where either one of the girls birth certificates are I guess we'll put one here and one here is fine okay so let's go see what they are discussing why is she doing she's like I gotta get back in shape immediately this is not gonna work let's go see what jackson does oh well he's taking care of them Okay, so we can't really find out anything about the babies until, well, let's do this. Oh my. We've got Jackson and Maya. They have together Jaleesa. And Maya has three kids without Jackson. She has Leah who is Jackson's stepdaughter, who is by Terrell. And then we have Jaden and Nathan. Wow. 
It just looks so different to see it actually on the family tree. Oh boy. Um, oh boy. I, I, jeez. Uh, and then it's just the poor little Nathan over here. I mean, Nadir by himself. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, we'll see what happens. Because I don't know. Like, I really don't. But we're going to today. Um, I forget all about Lucky, like, all the time. We're going to check Leah. Where is she? Leah, I need you to come in here. And actually go downstairs. Now we got crying babies again. Go downstairs and check. Of course, it's just three o'clock in the morning, but she's ready to get out of here. We have to set up power. Are you kidding? I'm going to have to take that mod out. <laughs> just. I didn't know it was something you had to do. I thought if you didn't do it, it would just stay. So I guess we'll just go ahead and do it. We need power. We need water. We need garbage collection. We'll do premium cable TV and we're going to do premium internet and cell phones. There. There we go. All right, let's do university. We're going to check the application status. I think we got all her scholarships already. What are you doing? You're chatting with Maya and Jackson. Leah, I need you to focus. I need you to come downstairs. Is her sister stuck? Jalisa, come over here. Use the bathroom. She's seriously stuck. Unbelievable. How do you get stuck there? All right, let me reset the sim. Now, Leah, please come check your application status. Thank you. We really don't care about different things that he has learned. It's fine. What are her skills? She's got archaeology. Archaeology. Now, someone said I should take her for history since she wanted to go for archaeology in the beginning. But I kind of wanted her to... I don't know. We'll see. I guess we'll see after we find out what she's doing. I don't want to talk to you. I want her to get up and go over there. Now fill that bowl. I guess you could go in your mother's room. I don't see anyone taking care of the babies. Check your status. Go. Do that. Oh, Jackson is really being go a good father at this point. Nadir has not said anything. Yeah, let's check your status. Okay, and this is what we did last time, I believe. She got an acceptance letter, so now we get to pick which one. Um, This one has art history. Hmm, physics. 
history. Foxberry has just regular history. Um, let's go to the thing where we get to choose the university and we're going to go ahead and get her. We're going to go ahead and get her signed up. She got accepted to both. So this is cool. We're going to go ahead and enroll and we're going to leave these people to do whatever it is that they do with their lives because it's time for Leah. What? Oh, she's thinking about her dad. <gasps> She's scary to go to college and she's like, oh man, I'm leaving my dad. Cool. Wow. All right. So mm, I think we're going to go to Foxbury. Does anyone ever go to the University of Rochester? Like Okay, uh, maybe. So we could do art history. Oh, she didn't get a distinguished degree. She didn't have good enough skills. Okay, she could do communication, computer science. History, let's see. To move forward, we must understand, wow, our past. The history degree uses historical people and events as a jumping off point for examining our modern age and consequences of major historical choices. The degree helps build the charisma, logic, and research and debate skills. A degree allows for entering at mid-level with a signing bonus while increasing daily pay, job performance, and vacation days on the following careers, a judge or a politician. But we want to be... A lawyer. I really don't see her as a judge. There we go. Private attorney. Language and literature. Hmm. Drama, of course, is not what we're looking for. Computer science is not what we're looking for. Communications, mm -mm. I think we're gonna have to go. She could be a professor. I just don't see her doing that. So I think we're just going to do language and literature for um, the private attorney. Yeah, because I haven't really done anything with that career. All right. So... I've done the four classes. I think in the beginning, we are going to give her a super hard workload just to get things done. So she's going to have interpreting the word, conquering the page, setting the scene. Is that me drawing from life? Um, but then she doesn't get an elective. I think we're good with that. She doesn't have to have an elective right now. She's going first semester full steam ahead so we're gonna do that and we're gonna no we're not gonna do um we're not gonna do at home and we're not gonna do off campus even though we could where they can live on their own but she's gonna be a first year student she is a young adult though University housing, there's eight beds. Um, personal inventory before moving as they will not be able to alter university housing directly once moved in. Uh, can you still go to like the different things at the university if you live off campus?
I think we're gonna do um I think we're gonna do this. I wanna do university housing. I haven't done that yet. So we're gonna see what that is. It's expensive, but she can afford it. All right. Um So she's got a Newcrest resident scholarship and a merit scholarship. So her total cost is only $1,000. We're going to um, pay with student loans, which is going to give her a lot to have to pay back, but she'll be fine. Pay that with student loans. It's just her. Oh. Oh, my goodness, Jaleesa. Oh, my God. All right, we're not going to have her transfer any funds because she has things in her inventory that she can sell and have her own money. Hopefully that's enough for this semester. So, okay, so let's pause this because I want to look around. She has zero funds. <laughs> zero is like zero funds. All right, um, this is a cute bedroom. It's all pinkish. And there's a computer in these rooms already. <gasps> Ooh, is this your room? Oh, there's two beds in there. I don't want to, I don't want her to have to share a bed. What's up here? Ooh, we should take this one. I'm taking it. Okay, so Leah's going to have this upstairs bed and then... We're going to assign this bed to someone else. There we go. Oh, it's just her and the other girl. Why are there three beds then? Let's do a friendly introduction to our roommate. But before we do all that, guys, because I'm going to bring this part to a close, I guess we're going to have more roommates. Um, we're going to go ahead and sell the stuff that she has in her inventory because right now she has zero dollars. Um, and we're just going to sell everything doesn't really matter um she has computers in here we just want to what's that oh a dance floor yeah no she doesn't need that uh relic base fuse with can i fuse that with something to make it more money i guess i don't know send away for all Ooh, yeah let's do that Okay, she's got her presentation board. We don't need a dirt clump. Can we fuse this with the other one? I don't know if it makes it better. Oh, wait. We definitely want to send things away to see if they're real or not. Because if they are, they're more money. Um, I'm not sure why she has a live space squid, but we're going to sell that. We're going to sell this. We're going to extract that fossil. She got a freaking crocodile jaw. Okay. We've got some other stuff. $200. Black beans. Avocados we don't need. Uh, we don't need that. We don't need that. All right. That's our homework. We don't need a bunch. Of, you know what? We're going to keep that cheese. <laughs> In case she's out and about and she gets hungry. Fire foam. <gasps> Whoa, guys, I'm going through selling things and she's got something in here for $8,000. No wonder she didn't ask for any money from her parents. She doesn't need it. This girl's starting college doing very well. All right, so we're gonna send some stuff away. All right, let's push play and see if she can get some stuff sent away. We don't need a dirt clump. What is that noise? Weird. So she's got almost $10,000. Okay. So we're going to change her aspiration and we're going to make it like the school aspiration and then we're going to go ahead and bring this part to a close 
So she has to achieve level three research and debate. And then we move on. On the road to fame. No, we don't want that. But anyway, guys, this is going to go ahead and end this part. We have moved out. Leah is on her first semester. And we're just going to see how it goes. Um, she gets to move back home after the semester. So we're going to have her move back in and see what the family has been up to. And that's just how we're going to run it. She's going to be away to college, but she's still going to keep up with her family. So on the next part, we're going to get things going with her college degree. I know she has class in three days, four days, two days, four days. So we're going to do the homework for the setting the scene. How are you going to come right to college and be sleeping? We're going to do that first. Okay. A lot of things she has to do. She has to do take a final exam. She has to submit a term paper here um, and give a presentation. That's what this is for. So that's what we're going to do, guys. Um, if you like this part, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Any tips, hints, comments, or suggestions, please leave them down in the comment section below. Um, I, I haven't really played university too much, so... Uh, Suggestions are appreciated. What are some different things she can do on campus? She doesn't really need a computer because there are some in here, but um, I don't think there's one in her room. So I'm gonna look into that. Is that something she can do, like go on the college campus? Oh yes, she does. And still do things. So yeah, let me know guys and let me know how these things work. What are some different things she can do? Don't forget to smile. You just may make someone's day. Be kind to each other, guys. And most of all, have a blessed day. Bye, guys.